and welcome to our Cucina Rustica. My name is Pino Di Cervo and I have the pleasure of cooking with my mom. Mom, say hi to our friends. Ciao a tutti, io sono Filomena Di Cervo. Today we have a great pasta recipe. Now pasta is king in our family because not only do the kids love it, but the adults love it. Everybody loves pasta. Now this pasta here is probably something that you've never had before. We're going to make it with sun-dried tomatoes that we've made on our previous video. So to learn how to make those sun-dried tomatoes that are marinated, it's super easy. Watch our previous video. We're going to have pickled eggplants in there and lots of Parmigiano cheese. It's fantastic. So watch this. Watch how fast it comes together. Whether it's hot or cold as a cold pasta salad, this dish is fantastic. I want to take all the credit for inventing this recipe myself, but um, my mom did, and um, so mom, tell us the ingredients. Ci vogliono un po' di aglio, cipollina verde, pomodori secchi, sottolio, egg e plant. Oh, but you said it in English. Pasta, <laughs> sale e pepe, e a corsi un po' di formaggio parmigiano. Yeah, a little bit of parmigiano reggiano and some pepe pasta, oil, all the ingredients are set here. Now, what I like about this, this is pickled eggplants from Aurora. It comes hot or it comes mild. We like to choose the hot one. We're going to use the hot one today. We're going to get this all chopped up and ready to go. You did a good job, Mom. Thanks. All right, we're ready to assemble our dish. Mom, what do we need? We need the olio. A big pot. So this is a big pot because we're doing a whole package of pasta here because there's a lot of us and we're hungry. And this is something that's even better the next day. If you wanted to keep it for the next day, for your lunch tomorrow, make, make the whole recipe, make all of it. Trust me, you're gonna eat it all. Ma, what is next? Roast onions. Onions, green onion? Yeah. Okay. Garlic. What we're doing now is we're sauteing our green onion and our garlic with olive oil. And then you tell me what's wrong. It's not working? Oh, we're good, Mom. See, you need me just as much as I need you. So we have our eggplants that we've taken out of the jar and uh, drained. And these are our sun-dried tomatoes. They're really big, they're gorgeous. I'm just gonna chop them up a little bit because they're too big. Am I, you ready for me to put this all in? Soon. Soon, you, you let me know. You let me know. Okay. Okay, so eggplants go in. So you can see that only took about not even a minute. All you want to do is get that fragrance out of those red onions and out of those and out of that garlic. Not too long, because then the garlic's gonna burn. Sun-dried tomatoes. Do we want more? No be cheap, the color polish. That's really good. <laughs> I, I really don't know what to say, Mom. That was funny. You're you're pretty funny sometimes. Alright. How about now? Good? Okay. So, that doesn't take long at all. See how fast it came together? We've already boiled our pasta. We, par we boiled our pasta in a big pot of water. I drained it, and I'm just going to put it inside uh, the pot. Most important thing though is, when you're draining the pasta, make sure you save some of that pasta water, because we're going to use some of that pasta water to add in here, so it doesn't dry up our pasta. Excuse me. Here's our pasta. We're using pinna today. Any pasta works well. A long pasta, a short pasta, we just like pinna. So we're putting pinna in there. You get ma, you left some. Can you get it? Yeah. All right, we've got those. And then I'm gonna add some pasta water. Now for the exact measurements and for the exact recipe, visit our website, pinotechervo.com. All of it? Yes. We're gonna let that cook away for about a minute and then it's time to plate it. Here it is, folks, the finishing touches. It smells fantastic. That aroma in the air um, with that uh, sun-dried tomato and that pickled eggplant is fantastic. Mom, what do we need to do now? We're gonna finish it up. A little bit more oil. A little bit of oil. Very typical, traditional, to finish all pastas, risotto with a good drizzle of oil on top. And some Parmigiano cheese, is that there? And some freshly chopped basil. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I'm ready. Have my plate ready? Can I have some now, Mom, or do we have to wait for everyone to come? That's okay, you try. Okay, okay. Just, you know, someone has to try it, right? And luckily, we weren't too cheap on those sun-dried tomatoes. You see them all in there? You're going to want that. Make sure you get some perfect. That's good. All right, Mom. You could, you could tell our friends goodbye while I stuff my face. Dalla nostra cucina rustica, buon appetito. Sorry.